Hello everyone, welcome to another video. I just wanna say first off a massive thank you to everyone who supported my six years sober video. And you know, I, it really was a surreal experience that day. I just didn't know what to say. I was really taken back and you know, I was starting to remember all of the, those bad times and it's good to leave those times behind me, but it's also good to reminisce on how far you've come and you know, what not to turn back to sort of thing. So it was kind of like, had not had a lot of nostalgia. A lot of the bad times were brought back up and a lot of gratitude was brought up too. So I'm so grateful to be in the position that I am now and, I, and to show where I come from and where I'm at now. So people can see the progression, you know, and a lot of people just, I don't know, they just see like there's vegan activists and they just start getting angry at me and they don't realize that hey, you know, there's a transformation story behind me as well. And, you know, I just didn't just come to this conclusion. I, there was a process and there was a, uh, there was a process of evolution, self-revolution sort of thing and uh, awareness that come with it as well. Yeah, so I'm back from that big project that I was uh, contributing to. I obviously can't tell you much about that project. Well, let's just say that I... Um, was very outside of my comfort zone when it came to that because obviously I've been stung by media before and but this is something very different this is something that hasn't been done before to say I was outside of my comfort zone would be an understatement so there's planes flying overhead yeah so I cannot disclose anything by contract um, but, you know, you will know when it comes out. <laughs> it will be quite uh, big, I, I guess. I've got a good feeling about it. I mean, I've obviously voiced my, my fears to the team who are in control of it. And, you know, they, they quieten some of the fears and obviously once bitten, twice shy when it comes to media. But I'm really hoping for the best for this and I'm really hoping I can use my platforms to promote this instead of to debunk it <laughs> uh, that would be ideal so yeah three weeks contributing to that um, and now where do I go from here so see look at that Sun shining look at that Sun shining beautiful day here now I've just got this fire inside of my chest and I really want to spread it really want to spread it and it's always been here since I've been sober it's just like you're sober here's reality what can you do to make a positive difference and this vegan movement is at the pinnacle of importance at the moment. And it always has been. And, you know, not only for the trillions of sentient animals who are treated like nothing, disposed of, abused, raped and killed for unnecessary products, which is just the biggest injustice ever. But the earth is going to crap as well. So... We all got to sort of step up our game and continue stepping up our game. I don't think we should rest on our laurels just because we've done a few things um, activism wise. I mean, just because I've done a few things activism wise because I've made a few impacts here and there doesn't mean I should stop. This is just the beginning. And I'm really, I'm really wondering where to from here. But the thing is, I, don't, I never really like to plan things. There's planes flying overhead people riding in their bikes and cars driving around. The thing is, I never really like to plan too far ahead. The reason being is the universe usually shows me the way as it arises. The path is always shown. And that's how I live my life, and that's how I've lived my life uh, since I've been sober. Just get in alignment with what you want and it'll just happen. It'll happen like magic. So that's how I, 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 I don't actually plan things, I just follow my heart and I think everyone should live like that if they have the freedom to do that, this true freedom. I'm hoping to get a little help, a little team together, I just don't know how that will manifest. I really want some really keen helpers, maybe even someone young that's just, um, that's really motivated, wants to help animals. I could really do with an assistant to be honest, um, someone that can help me out um, and, and is keen to learn. 
um, that'd be great. Maybe a little team and maybe we can get something done here in England or maybe we can go somewhere else. I don't really know yet. But I just thought I'd voice uh, where I'm at generally and just obviously say thank you for all of the support that you gave me recently and give you a little update video <laughs> before I get back into it. Now, I've still got to finish uploading my Light Up The World tour. We're getting into the last few episodes of it now. That was crazy, but yeah, I'm, sh I'm really uh, looking forward to finishing that and starting off with a new venture. I love you all. Thank you for your support. And let's see where the next part of this journey takes us. Peace.